Fellas, Splatoon's got a lot of merch. Like, not like a little bit. Nintendo loves making Splatoon merchandise. It sells like hotcakes. We all kind of know this. Get out of my way! Look at me, I made my own hat. And I know, Nintendo's not about to be making replicas of anything out there, but a, but a couple of fun things might be nice. We're gonna start cheap and then get expensive. Yippee! <laughs> Listen, you do not need a hilariously underused economics degree like I have to know that maybe, just maybe, people eat food. And if you ask me, children eat candy, right? Turn the burst bomb, a weapon we already have in the game, into fruit gushers, like, like these, like these, and you will be set Nintendo. Sell them everywhere. I will buy, just so I could try them for fun. You've got me hooked, you've probably got other people hooked. Uh, bye bye <laughs> Have you ever felt as thirsty as an inkling or oxling probably does walking down the streets of Splatsville? Have you ever wanted to drink from your own ink tank? Worry no longer, because soon, coming to a store near you, don't worry about what store, I don't know yet, I'm just, I'm just the marketing team, man. <laughs> We've got jelly drinks! You've seen them at the store. Look, they're gonna pop up on the screen right now. Wow, wow, I bet three dollars. Three dollars for that, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm gonna be for real. I thought I had like a good clicky ballpoint pen on me and I don't. I, I just have like regular normal pens. In fact, I have like two of this same purple pen on my desk. I need to like variety my stuff some more. <laughs> but this is like a three in one right here, okay? Five dollars, you get first of all, number one, the ballpoint pen that you see right here. It looks like a ballpoint splatling. Number two, you get like a snipe writer stylized pencil. Could be a mechanical pencil, could be a normalized pencil. And number three, you get a Clash Blaster pencil sharpener. So this is a three in one for $5 Nintendo branded school supplies. Beautiful. <laughs> this one might be bad marketing. I'm gonna be real. Splatter color screen. People, people are kind of on the fence about this special. But you know what you could do with it? You could turn it into a pretty sick bandana. Come on, come on, come on. Look at this design. Tell me that it wouldn't look good on a bandana. And bandanas are relatively cheap. Like, like watch this. People are selling bandanas online for like $2 a pop, $3 a pop, $5 a pop. Sell a bandana for like $5. Put like two different ink colors, like the Splatoon 3 classic ink colors in there. And you're set, Nintendo. You're welcome. Have you ever been really stressed while playing Splatoon? Probably pretty common with most of us. This is not very squishy. When you're playing a game of Splatoon, running around with your Splattershot Jr., this sucks. You don't want to run around with this thing. Get, get, get this, get this out of here. Get this out of here. You want something that's squishier, something that is satisfying to crush. Well, you know what? Listen, you've got a torpedo. Imagine turning a torpedo into a squishy little stress toy. You know how awesome that would be? Make it like $5? Good, thanks. After talking about torpedoes and stress, maybe you need to just cool down with a nice meal. The staff lady has got you covered with all these lovely meals here. But like, what if, what if I, what if I wanna buy one for $5? IRL, Nintendo. The opportunity is arising. Imagine being able to go to your local 7-Eleven, your Walmart, your stop and shop, and pick up a frozen meal of one of these. That'd be so awesome. Come on, do it. $8. Let it compete with some of the other under $10 fidget items out there. I bet it would sell pretty good. Stocking stuffer. Fantastic and fun. Give it like five different twisty options. Let you twist the base, twist like the nozzle on the side, twist the parts where the ink like comes out in game. You've got this, Nintendo. Go! Listen, guys, picking between these three for Splatfest is really hard. What's your win rate right now? As of right now, when this comes out, I've won um two. Wouldn't you like the opportunity to be able to just Make the results happen yourself. That's so you don't have to go mashing through results and be sad about it. Well, I've got the fix for you. One second. Results that a lot of people maybe weren't happy about. People or me. I was on Team Grub. Zero points hurts. But you know what? Hear me out on this. We have the perfect solution. Bada bing. 
Para. I'm not reaching for the mouse or anything. Dry erase cards. All Nintendo has to do is make them set up with all the categories of tricolor turf war, open, pro, etc. All in one set of cards. Put like 10 colors in there, and people can make whatever custom splatfests they want and show off whatever results they want. Easy. Good. Bye. $10. Right now, I am at the beach. I am so at the beach right now. Look at my inkling in her flipper floppers and her scuba gear. And man, oh man, even at the beach, you can't escape the crab tank. It's floating around in the water just like a beach ball. Oh, it would be such a shame if we had beach balls in the game. Or maybe even IRL. How much do you think adding the little crabby bits up top would cost? Hopefully not too much. What if they gave us two crab tanks? One for you and one for a friend for like 15 bucks. I mean, hey, they, they, they're already only they're only 20 bucks for four of them on the Pokemon website, so... This is not business professional of me, but I really like hats, okay? And what would be better than seeing a crab tank as a hat. Please, just imagine a hat with with a, with the little with the little eyes on the front. Just that, just that. That's it. It could, it could just be yellow. It could just be the plain base yellow crab tank. I want it. Give me it. Give me it. Please. Please, please. I'm asking. I'm asking so nicely. You know, I was going to use the Lapras pool float for this example here, but this Mantike pool float is $30, and if you ask me if, if I if I get out of the way, it's, 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 this is this is pretty reef slider shaped, ain't it? Ooh, you know what that means? Maybe we could get $30 reef slider float? This thing would sell like hotcakes. We'd be fighting to get our hands on it. Please, please, Nintendo. $30 reef slider float. That's, that's all, that's all I ask. I'm gonna be for real. I thought a big bubbler, like a, like a pop-up big bubbler was a really good idea. Until I realized how expensive big bubble transparent domes are. I was like, oh yeah, camping dome. Great idea, great idea, Victoria. Fantastic idea. Gonna work really well at the meeting today. And you know what? I'm thinking it might not have been such a good idea. We've got one. We've got one random Amazon tent that happens to be like 40 bucks. Could we say that Nintendo could probably make one for 50 bucks? Maybe. So I'm gonna set it at 50 bucks and hope for the best. Um, bye. <laughs> Fellas, fellas, we're entering expensive territory, like real dollars here. You see these drones? They're not new. They've been in Splatoon 3 the whole time. Let's make them into real life drones. Like drones you could fly around. You know how awesome that would be to be able to do that? But um, I don't think it'd be very cheap. Have you seen the price of an average drone? I think, I think we're hitting $100 here. I think this is the first item that we're gonna have to cross the threshold or get really close about. 99? 99. Take it or leave it, Nintendo. Thanks. Okay, this one's like slash gen. Why are wireless speakers so expensive? I thought like making a six pack of wireless speakers for the Killer L 5.1 was like was like a good idea. Like literally I thought it was like I was like, this is so smart. It's fun, it's silly, you could put them all around your house. A, a decent wireless speaker is like 20, 30 bucks. So like, I mean you could make six of them, but it would be, I don't know. $120? Uh... I think I found the perfect silly luxury item to end this video with, okay? Marina's laptop. Whether you're making like a $300 generic family computer, or you're like doing a $3,000 gaming laptop. Oh god, I said $3,000, I meant like a thousand. 